Welcome to the Thargoid Report. I'm Commander Burr. This is a distillation of the excellent weekly thread from Burton Simmons on Reddit. For finer details on the why and the what of the Thargoids activity then do give that post a look. I've linked it below. If you find this information useful and enjoy our content then please consider giving the video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to make sure you see all our future videos. Burton Simmons is ducking out of the Thargoid reportage game and this is to be his final report after a year of regular weekly updates. The weekly reddit post has been an invaluable asset to the community and I'd just like to extend my personal thanks and a solid 07 to the good commander. We are all in your debt. The following stations were attacked by Thargoids this week and are currently on fire and subject to ongoing rescue operations. Ezra Point in Witch Head Sector LCV C210. Cheryl Orbital in Witch Head Sector HWW C19. Carrion Vision in Witch Head Sector FBX C111. Sal Prospect in Witch Head Sector HWW C17. Can Relay in Witch Head Sector GWW C14 and Hannah Enterprise in Witch Head Sector DLY D17. At the time of recording only some of the stations are showing passenger missions so if the board is empty when you get there try one of the other stations. Also it's worth checking the discord for the post disaster evacuation service which I've linked below. That's an entire community dedicated to conducting rescue operations from the Thargoid affected stations. There you'll find advice and be able to link up with other commanders participating in the relief efforts. They'll have the latest information on what stations to focus on. As well as evacuating civilians from these stations you can also help delivering food, water, basic medicines and natural fabrics to the affected stations. If you are going into a burning station bring all the heat sinks. Links to my previous videos on this subject are below. If you're looking to attack Thargoids then there are currently no new infestations being reported by the Eagle Eye Network. The best place to find scouts at the moment is either Palin's old research facility on Maya A3A or track down uh, non-human signal sources in the Pleiades region in general. If you are engaging in anti-Thargoid scout combat operations you don't necessarily need specialised equipment but the entry level anti-xeno weaponry requires no unlocking and it really helps. The scout class vessels also count as elite ranked ships so this is an excellent way to level up your combat rank. For the more hardcore combat zone encounters the following systems are under Thargoid incursion right now and will have combat zones that feature scouts as well as the larger Thargoid vessels. Witch Head Sector DLY D17. Witch Head Sector GWW C14. Witch Head Sector HWW C17. Witch Head Sector HWW C19 and Witch Head Sector FBX C111. Witch Head Sector LCV C210 was in a state of incursion but has already been cleared as at the time of recording. The AXI Discord is running a series of assaults in the Witch Head Sector this week to clear the remaining combat zones and there is a special rank in their Discord of Lernaean Seeker up for grabs if you're involved in clearing one of those combat zones. For the scouts and the death daisies I'd recommend decontamination limpets are added to your standard arsenal and you might want to think about taking shed loads of heat sinks as well. The cone sector critters will struggle to track you when you're cold. With the assistance of the AXI Discord all the systems I've listed this week are now presented in priority order. If you're looking to wing up with other commanders then there's links below to the AXI, the Hive and the Hand. Between them these organisations have all platforms covered, they're a really friendly bunch and whatever your level of competence they'll help you fight bugs. Wherever you go commanders remember pick your fights with care. If you want to get involved with the repair efforts and help get stations back online after an attack then head over to Operation IDA. IDA coordinate the rebuilding efforts for the wider galactic community and will have you covered on where to go and what to bring with you. All you need is a galactic map and a few cargo racks. They're also linked below. 
That's it for now, thank you so much for making it this far. You can also find us on Twitter, Patreon, Discord and Instagram. Links to all those are in the description below and we'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then O7 CMDRs may all your high predictions be brief and don't let the horror daisies give you nightmares. I very much look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you.